Tuesday, we reach 70 degrees, but balmy weather will soon be in our rearview mirror. But after two consecutive snowy winters, could Mother Nature be shooting from three-point land? Migratory waterfowl on Heron Pond at Three Creeks Metro Park in southeastern Franklin County found a rest stop along the Elm Creek Greenway, a sign of winter. A folklore would tell you that animals gathering lots of nuts means that we're going to have a really severe winter. But it's really more about how much fruit is out here in nature already. An autumn hike will reveal the handiwork of some furry friends. So the beaver are going to carry this down to the creek and they'll store it underwater so when the water freezes they can get to their food source all winter long. These are their incisors, really big and thick so that they can chew on the wood all winter. Deer rubs are also visible in the woods. They rub their antlers here as part of their mating season, so it's how they're going to let the females know that they're here and available. Right now, nature is crawling with signs of winter. This guy is showing us that we're going to have a pretty mild winter. Some believe the 13 segments of the woolly bear caterpillar each represent a week of winter. If that's true, these darker bands at the head would suggest a cold early winter than a thaw. A lot of it really has to do with their early development. Increasing sunspot activity and a cooling of the tropical Pacific both point to a stormy winter, so our smooth sailing now could really be the calm before the first winter storm. Meteorologist Ben Gelber, NBC4, Columbus.